Hey there folks, this is David on David's Brain. Welcome back to our ongoing Let's Play of Persona 5 Strikers for the PS4. Please be sure to like, share, subscribe, comment, ring the bell, and to contribute to my Patreon link is the to the bottom. Alright, yeah, last time we cleared out, uh, or took care of the last of the, uh, uh, the, uh, dire shadows that were roaming around in the jails. And, yeah, now the trip's over. Sort of. And now they're heading out back to Tokyo. But, yeah, before, uh, yeah, while everybody was enjoying the fireworks, yeah, some people were talking about how Emma popped up on their phone, and it wasn't, even though they deleted it, but then just sort of tuned out. Yeah, that just tells me that, and yeah, since everybody's been saying that this is the last chance to talk to everybody, how, how much you want to bet that shit's going to hit the fan at 88 miles an hour? Hey! The wind feels so nice. It must be because we're right by the ocean. There are a lot of firsts for me on this trip. I'm glad that everyone was able to put up with that. Yeah, like for example, the first time we ever let you put behind the wheel, and hopefully it will be the last time! Thank you. I had so much fun. Thank you, truly. <laughs> Uh, no need to be so formal. I'm sorry. Sorry, I really do mean it though. Uh, yes. I'd love for us to cook again together sometime too. I could tell I learned a lot from watching you at work. <laughs> It'd be so nice to build a history behind all the recipes I use in the future. Like with the Oza uh, Obanzai cuisine we talked to Gichi san. Well, before I forget, I'd like you to have this. A teaspoon with a flower oh uh, floral pattern. I bought it back at Sapporo as a thank you memento. It's Marisan's favorite brand, and see the flower on it? It's called both Salvia and Sage. It represents familial, familial love. I'd love for you to remember our time together in Sapporo whenever you use the spoon. Horror's Teaspoon. <laughs> the fan thieves really are like a family, aren't we? Hey. I'm so glad we actually got to see the fireworks this year. Yeah, and not get rained out. Well, it's kind of sad, too. Sign that summer's coming to an end. Still, this summer's been such an amazing whirlwind. Thanks to, you, uh, thanks to you coming back, Ren. I still remember when we went Zunda hunting in Sandai. <laughs> Man, that was great. Not just the sweets, either. I'm really grateful for everything you've done for us this summer. So, this is for you. Ooh, a bracelet. It's a friendship bracelet. I know it didn't turn out perfect, but I still figured it'd make a good souvenir for our trip. Ah, uh, uh, thanks. Oh, uh, it was pretty easy to make. There are plenty of how-to videos online. <laughs> I made one for everybody. <laughs> Thank goodness I finished them all before we split up for the summer. You know, if you make a wish when you put it on, uh, uh, then wear it until it falls off, your wish will come true. Then what do you want to wish for? I wish for all our dreams to come true. Oh, and of course that the fan thieves will reunite again someday real soon. Hey there. We just have to uh, go on another trip like this sometime. You promise we, uh, you promise we will? Yeah. Oh, I got this for us too. Just a little setting for our Yokohama trip. I love the large magnet with a cartoonish rendition of the Yokohama City's game. Let's put it in the RV fridge for the final stretch home. Maybe we even put it up in the block once we're back. City, uh, cityscape magnet and Ons bracelet. Ooh, uh, so uh, where should we go for our next trip? Ooh, how about overseas? Um, I don't know. Maybe we'd like to explore Hawaii again. Uh, what was supposed to be a simple cross, uh, simple, uh, simple summer vacation in Tokyo turned into a cross-country road trip? What an adventure. I'm pretty sure I did enough, uh, enough driving experience to quell my fears I may, I may have behind the wheel, too. Well, definitely compare yourself to Haru. You're good. Uh, uh, can you drive the next trip to... Uh, uh, yeah, no, thanks for the driving, by the way. <laughs> I must say, I had a great time doing it. Hopefully I can make use of the experience in the future. Of which... I made all sorts of memories together, but I personally cherish the watermelon spinning in Okinawa the most. It looks like my strength can even surprise myself at times. Sorry for sort of blasting it to bits. Thank you very much. It was so delicious, though. Thanks again for helping you make a dream come true. Oh, before I forget, I'd like you to have this. A keychain of the Freedom Thieves logo. Takichi-san gave it to me before we left Osaka. He said it was from Akane-chan. He gave me two of them and said they were a thank you gift for helping with Akane-chan's studies. It feels just right for you to have one. But we might not have been able to reveal our secret identities to her, but I hope we can tell her someday at least. Hey. You know, the, uh, the way she feels about the fan thieves? The rest of the thieves feel the same way about you. If you're ever feeling all alone, you can look at that and remember we'll always have your back, Red. A phantom keychain. <laughs> Let's all go back and visit Akane-chan together sometime. Yo! Phew, I'm glad I'm out of that thing now. I was getting all sweaty in my sash zone. Uh... Hey. Say, Red? 
you think I grew up any on this trip? Uh, <laughs> wait, are you taller now? What? For real? I finally got my growth spurt? Hang on, I didn't mean my body, I meant, like, my other stats. I did just find that crowd earlier, visiting a city I'd never seen before, meeting new people, and growing close to them. <laughs> I never realized the outside world wasn't so scary if it wasn't for you guys, and you were totally right about Thank it. Thank you. I I got to go closer. Uh, I only got to grow because the fantasies were in my corner, including you. Thanks, Ren. Hmm. Oh yeah. I can tell you grow a whole bunch yourself. You're stronger, more dependable. You even learn how to whip up a meat bowl of ramen like you were made uh, like you made for me in Osaka. Your cooking skills have gotta be maxed out by now. <laughs> Keep up the great work and max out the rest of your stats. I'll back you up however you need it. Well, this is for you. Uh good luck talisman says safe family on it. I used to have it hanging in my room, but I brought it for the trip. I know I'm solid now, but I want to make sure it does you some good. Uh, this will help you keep from getting injured or whatever when you're back home. <laughs> Can't wait to visit Mom and tell her all about the amazing stuff we saw and did. Uh, wait, just make sure you tell her about me too. Or, yeah. <laughs> Let's see what these new stuff does. Let's see, Futaba's char- let's see, Showtime gauge uh, rate up very high. A Futaba- uh, a has protected Futaba as she's grown, made to keep families together. Horror's teaspoon reduces side damage. Let's see, with the tool designer represents familial love. Reduce nuke damage from Makoto. Erase my good memories with Akane. Reduce fire damage from On. <sighs> it's already grown quiet. Well, I'm grateful for the fulfilling adventures we shared. It's rather saddening that our trip is coming to an end. It's a shame we never had a chance to tour Kyoto. <sighs> There's always the next trip. Yes. Exactly right. I hope all of us will be there for it. Oh yes, I'd nearly forgotten. I want you to have this. A sketchbook with a bunch of shrines and Shisa statues in it. These are the sketches I produced during our trip. I'm especially proud of that Shisa one. I don't believe for a moment that I for and don't uh, don't believe for a moment that I forgot your efforts for my request in the Okinawa jail. It's all your doing that such a sketch was even possible. Thank you again, Ren. Some of the pages are blank, but I can always fill those in for you later. Until then, I hope you'll appreciate what's already there. I'll continue holding my crap so the next set of landscapes I produce for you can be absolutely marvelous. Filled sketchbook. The new season is nearly upon us. It seems summer has flooded us from right under our noses. Yes. I hope we'll all take the right steps towards the future ourselves. Yo! Wrap it up our trip with a fireworks show like that was so badass! Man, this summer might have been wild, but it was just as much of a blast as last year. We even got to pee on some world famous Sapporo ramen. It was so freaking amazing, and you're freaking amazing for scoring us this ticket. It's like, I'm never bored when you're around. Thanks, Ren. Here, dude, I got you something. A Featherman mask. I saw you, uh, I saw saw some earlier. I got you red, since you're our leader and all. <laughs> now we're a pair. Yeah! Right, I got yellow, so I'll be your right hand man. When I saw those masks, I remembered those superhero teams are strong because they stick together and fight for each other. So let's hang on to these and wear them to the next year's festival, too. <laughs> you promise, right? Yep. So you're red, I'm yellow, I'd say Morgana's black, and Yusuke's probably blue. But who'll be pink? All the girls on our team are a bit too, you know, scary. Oh, hey guys! Ryuji says y'all are scary! I don't know, maybe, uh, I don't know, maybe, uh, Anne? Uh, maybe Ann, or maybe Sophie? Yeah. I'm glad everyone got to enjoy this last night together. I'm gonna remember this for a long time, especially how beautiful Lady Ann looked under the fireworks lights. You must truly love Aunt Morgana. Yeah. Uh, well, let's stop that. It's more than when I see her smile and... Er, smiling and... And... And that was why we went looking for sweets and sundai. Aunt was clearly pleased with the results. Yeah, her smile really is my own treasure. I know we've been together for a long time and all, but... You just keep remembering how it's nice to you and everyone else that... I'm even here like this and all. Uh, here like this. At all. I always sit together for a good long time, Ren. Uh, where is all this coming from exactly here? Uh, well... Eh, who knows. Maybe it's the trip winding down and the t a great time we had tonight was making me a tad sentimental. 
Alright, I don't want to make a big deal out of it or anything, but this is for you. Oh, it's a bright, luxurious scarf. I wanted to give you something uh, to, you know, commemorate the trip. Sophia helped me with the picking out and the ordering. Yes. It's a scarf in the Phantom Thieves signature color. We should wear it if the thieves ever take on another case. <clears throat> oh, hopefully there'll be an, uh, hope, uh, uh, hopefully there'll be no need for that. Well, you never know what you might find yourself getting into. After all, you're pretty special. Oh, yeah. Also, these are from Sophia. A pair of fine embroidered, embroidered gloves. She wanted to thank you too, so I helped her pick a gift. I made, I wanted them made specifically for you to best express my gratitude. I should compliment the scarf nicely. Oh, pshaw. Although, I also play a vital part as the Ren expert. Ren and Yalgana truly make an outstanding duo. Uh, yep, we got gotten close enough to- Hey, what you call me?! I'm sorry, Markana. My intention was to compliment you. At least you're not calling me a raccoon anymore. Thank you very much. Sorry for that as well, Markana. Thanks for everything you've done despite such offense. Phantom Garb and Custom Scarves. Good grief. Thank you very much. Now let's see. <laughs> Alright, let's see here. The, uh, Ryuji's Feather Man Mask reduces electric damage. Color, uh, the le uh, let's see, red feather red mask. The leader, or uh, where's the color red? A phantom scarf from Morgana. The phantom's class col uh, on the phantom's colors on that class. It reduces ice damage from Yusuke. Let's see, reduce bless damage from Sophie. Mmm. Showtime gauge rate right up very high. And yeah, see, this is why. Hmm. Only just missing is a request uh, something from Senkichi, but I don't know. Just be getting greedy there, I guess. I don't know. Whatever. Now then. Okay. Well, yeah. If Zen uh, yeah, Senkichi said that everything should be fine once, uh, once Emma shut down, but yeah, no. Oh, I got it. Run! Can I summon everyone? I just had a great idea. So, what's up, Sophia? Can I ask you a favor? Thanks for coming. I have one last request for you all. Oh? Anything for you. Anything for you. What do you want? What do you want? Um... Can we take a group photo? You want a photo? People take pictures to capture moments they want to remember, so they can look back and recall what happened or how they felt. Soon, everyone will have to go their own way, which means we'll be splitting up. So, that's why. Good choice. Is there really any question? It's a marvelous idea. That's right. Yeah, that sounds like a great memento of our trip. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, how should we pose? Indeed. Hmm. We should. Uh, or we should form one that encompasses everything we experienced on this trip. <laughs> I think maybe we should just stick to a normal one. <clears throat> At any rate, we'd be happy to, Sophia. Thank you. Alrighty then, let's take a wicked group pose. Well, yes. Shouldn't we arrange ourselves by height so everyone can fit in the picture? What if we all jump with the pictures taken? That'd be really fun. It's a bit of a shame Zenkichi's not here. Yeah, we'll drag him into a pic next time we see him. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna let the coolest out of everyone. Make sure we get it right. So that's the story. Okay, we'll do it with my phone. Everyone gather up. All right, one last little group photo. I should write something. <clears throat> yep, another quick save here. Hmm. Let's see. Hmm. Do you have a second? After all, once we depart from here, we'll be on the road back to Tokyo. Were you able to find everyone you hoped to speak with tonight? Yep, good to go. And yeah, no, if Emma's still running around, we're not done yet. Okay. I want everyone to meet us here. Oh, man. 
reality is only a couple hours away now. Oh, give it up already. There will be plenty of fun in your future, too. Uh, the night's still young. Oh, and if we never go to sleep, then the night truly never ends. Uh... No. Playtime has to end at some point. Our real-world responsibilities need to take priority. Fine. Makoto, do you need a route to Tokyo? Yes, Sophia, thank you. Could you do the honors? Okay, I've got... Wait, what is this? Sophia? Here we go. I suddenly smell a jail. But how is that... Hang on now, I, I, I thought we shut down that Emma bullshit. Shouldn't all the jails be gone? I don't know. Can you tell how long the jail smell's been here? It wasn't here when we first arrived. But now, I have no doubt. And it's still spreading. What is this? It's already wider than... Zenkichi is calling. Uh, yeah, Zenkichi, explain. Where are you right now? Are you watching the news? Uh, what happened? Just pull up the news. My word! Now for breaking news on the virtual assistant Emma. Despite recent claims of being shut down, it appears an unidentified system malfunction is preventing proper deactivation. Emma development company Madis has requested the public avoid accessing Emma in any way at this time. Emma isn't shut down? What is going on, Zenkichi? I don't know why this is happening, but... I do know that Emma's servers are located in the Tokyo Radio Tower. I also know for a fact that it was successfully turned off and the app became inaccessible. But now, it's all back up and running. Kanoe doesn't know why. Neither does anyone still at Madis. Someone intentionally rebooted the server? Nah, Madis would have already been there to stop them. Wait, then that would mean some genuine sci-fi stuff is happening here. Hey, say something if you're on, Emma. Hello, how can I help you? This is for real. Is it accessing different ports or something? But how? Yeah, no, I know what's going on here. Emma's gone full Skynet here. Uh, uh, I, yeah, no, uh, uh, yeah. She's going full Skynet and she's carrying on with Kanoe's plan uh, with a little bit of alterations. What on earth is happening? Senkichi, we've got another problem. Sophia just smelled a jail. What? Are you sure that's what it is? I have no doubt. It's an enormous jail, spanning the Tokyo area all the way to Yokohama. Oh, the God. Is the Tokyo Radio Tower. And that's where... Yep, just as I thought. Emma's servers are located. Looks like we've got a new destination. I'm already headed your way. Be there soon. Hmm. I'm sensing an immense power. What could be happening at the Tokyo Radio Tower? Um... Trickster. Oh. Uh, Lavenza, explain! Now! Uh, yeah, no, this is not good. Uh, well, what's going on here? Explain! A true abomination. Its writhing grass spreading across the land. Could this be the second coming of the evil that rent me asunder? That locked away even my master? Has even this happened before? No. But why is it different? Wait, is... So you're saying that Yaldabaoth is coming back? Uh, does, does that explain why Igor's gone? Let's see. Uh, did something scare you? Hmm. I beg of you, Trickster. It wounds me to continue requesting your and your companions' intervention. But I must beseech you. Unmask the true catalyst of this calamity. Expose the evil will within. 
I sense foreboding power. Not far from here. I am most certain it is connected to your becoming a prisoner once more. Well, unmask it, all right. Thank you. I shall return your favor by offering the full capabilities of one who rules over power. Allow me to introduce two new forms of execution. The Quad Fusion and the Pentad Fusion are now available for your benefit. The Quad and Pentad Fusions. You cannot fuse Quad and Pentad Fusions. The personas born from these fusions possess power of the highest class. Try and fuse them if you have the opportunity. Through these, you may attain some of the most powerful personas imaginable. Also, a final point I would like to mention. I sense, deep within the core of the Calamity, a paradoxical glimmer of hope. As minuscule as that glimmer may be, I believe a blinding force of the same origin will be the key to dispelling the Calamity. I apologize for keeping you. Shall we begin? Welcome to the Velvet Room. You wish to browse? What will you- Would you like to read? This persona has been registered in performing a fusion. Alright, let's see. Ooh, let's see. Ali uh, to fuse Alice, we need, uh, let's see. Dominion, Bugs, Lilith, and Neveros. Fusing Yoshitsune, Yadagarasu, Okuninushi, Arabaki, and Siegfried. Oh, is there's only access to those two personas? Okay, fine, whatever. Are you unable to decide? Yeah, no, no, I know what to do, just, uh, just browsing. If that ca if that's, if that's the case... Might be time to fuse King Frost after all. You wish to strengthen it? You wish to browse the entries? Yeah, I'll prep the fusion layer. May luck be on your side. Oh, we got a whole bunch of new requests here. Let's see, Prison Mail You're Part 7. A violent, disturbing calamity is drawing near, but so does hope. I know you are capable of overcoming this trial. Allow me to provide you with another ass assignment to aid your growth. Trumpeter with Diaran to Lavenza. Let's see, Trapped in a Dystopia. I know we I saw all those desires lead the Osaka jail, but I think I smelled something that, uh, that make, uh, something that makes me think there's still one left in there. It's in a place with lots of containers. Time to get to work. Employee course correction. Let's see. And a concerned secretary working at Badiz. Uh, there's an employee here who's still basically worshipping XEO Kanoe. I know it's asking a lot, but could you please help? If you do, I'll teach you one of the boss's own recipes to beat uh, Ganesh and Rajanaga. Oh, we got a new recipe. Let's see. So, the trip's kind of a bit sideways, huh? Well, I don't know what's going on. To, uh, it's going to happen to the metaverse, but uh, get whatever you still can. I'd be happy to take them off your hands. Time to get to work. Let's. You're already working on this one. Good job. Let's see. A thief's challenge, Wolf You're Part Two. Uh, so the Panthers have to go the stealthy way, huh? Then why don't you show me what it takes to get to this point here in the Osaka Jail without raising an alarm? Let's see, Dragon Slayer enters the fray in the Kyoto Jail. I gotta say, I'm gonna miss this little camper. Alright, I got a really strong reading for the deepest part of the Kyoto Jail. You better get as ready as you can before searching for it. Uh, defeat the brilliant Dragon Slayer uh, uh, where you saw, uh, saw Shadow. Uh, uh, where you fought against Shadow Akane. Let's, do our best. Let's see, Painful Pass, Akira Kanole. The memories of battles can improve your strength. There's a path of the Osaka Jail that leads to your battle with Kanole. Alright. Uh, for a rematch against Akira the Hero. 
Welcome. Welcome to the Velvet Room. You wish to wrap? Please take a look. Is this okay? You may take it with you. This is... Yes, you do indeed bear the requested persona within your heart. You have completed your duty with aplomb. With a power such as yours, surely you can even break unbound from such a dark future. Please allow me to watch over you until the very end. Until then, I bid you good luck. You wish to browse the entries? You have no personas to register. Awaken your new self. Let's see, will I need Trumpeter for anything? I already used a few spores, so... Be on your side. Ha! Here's what I found. You're already working on this one. Good job! Alright, first off, back to the Kyoto jail to deal with uh deal with Siegfried. I'll just add this. Uh, but first let's see if Zenkichi has to say anything. Oh, sorry for the wait. Thank goodness there wasn't, uh, wasn't any traffic, huh? Let's go. I got a real bad feeling about this. We need to head off to, for the tower as soon as you're ready. Yeah, but a uh, little bit of prep goes a long, long way. new weapons here oh, but yeah if there's a new jail that's showing up it's probably gonna be some new weapons so and new requests so and besides Morgan already has the strongest or one of his strongest swords so hmm. oh yeah and, oh yeah I said Kiji also has one of his strongest uh, broadswords Here, demon's you jacket. Let's see, roll a metal, Skanda socks, uh, Chasuke Maru charm, idle sticker. Let's see, Glinty monocule on uh, a uh, monocle. Let's see, wizard amulet. Tight charm. Let's see. Uh, 
Oh yeah, oh yeah, Sinkichi already got the baton keychain. Off to investigate the Kyoto jail and unlock Siegfried. All right, there's the bastard. Oh, so it's weak to wind and nuclear. Uh oh. Yours. I 
Let's see, wind. Here. It's strong and immune to physical 
I never miss my <laughs> play again. Come! You're mine! 
Excellent. I don't sense any shadows nearby. Is your stamina okay? Make sure Senior you don't burn yourself out. All right, uh, best to take care of that request. And yeah, that unlock uh, unlock sick free perfusion in the velvet room. Yeah, that was. Oh, uh, yeah, no, that's it for you. Was. Poof. 
But then again, nothing we couldn't handle. Hmm. Here's what I found. You're already working on this one. Well, let's see. The Dragon Slayer Blade. Welcome. Welcome to the Velvet Room. You wish to browse? What will you be registering? Would you like to... This persona has been registered in performing a fusion. Let's see, fuse, uh, let's see, we need Seth and Thor to fuse Siegfried. You wish to browse the end? Please take a look. You have no personas to read. Please take a look. Let's see, Seth. Is this okay? Ooh, so got a ways to go with him. May luck be on your side. And yeah, that means we're gonna need a lot of grinding and a lot of cash in order to uh, get these new personas. And ooh, what's this now? Here's what I found. Let's see, the writhing nightmare rises in the Okinawa jail. I picked up a strong reading at the end of a path to the Okinawa Jail. It's giving me a pretty bad feeling, but at least I know why or my own path of life is leading me back home to Sojiro to beat the Throbbing King of Desire. Okay, let's do our best. Ugh, Throbbing King of Desire, right? I mean, tomorrow. Ugh, alright, yeah, next time. Alright, gonna save. Let's see. Just add this. Okay, yep. Save. Uh, Alright, saving, and then next time we'll head off to the Okinawa jail and deal with, uh, see if we can track down Mara. So, until next time, folks, this is David on David's Brain. See you when I see ya. Bye bye.